so here we are with progressive mode. We are at one second division. Um, progressive mode kicks in at 200 millisecond division. And notice we get to the end of the buffer. Uh, we did see momentarily that this waveform was filtered. Hopefully you'll see in a second because I do have a low pass filter applied here. Quite an aggressive one, 100 hertz. So just look what happens when we get to the end of the buffer before we roll on to the next one. We're live on seven at the moment. Just momentarily, it changed to a thin line because filtering was applied. And then we moved to buffer eight. So what I wanted to do was add some high frequency noise. So on the next waveform now, I'm just applying this nuisance noise, a couple of spikes. And you'll see that momentarily they'll get filtered out and then we move to the next buffer. But what we can do now when we um, switch on previous progressive waveform feature, switch that to on, we'll be able to see filtered and unfiltered data. So in a second, when we get to the end of the buffer, we'll start drawing a vertical line across the screen. On the right hand side is buffer 11, the previous buffer, and live drawn from left to right is buffer 12. So let's put some noise on this signal now. And notice what happens as we roll around to the next buffer. So now we're seeing the filtered buffer 13 and the live buffer unfiltered, 14 here on the right hand side. And then the same again as we roll round. So live on the drawn from left to right is buffer 15, but underneath ever diminishing was buffer 14. I hope that helps.